Hey guys, happy new year. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited for what is to come this new year. I hope you're having a great day so far. In today's video, I'm going to show you a few glam home decor DIYs using items from the Dollar Tree. I hope after you see these DIYs, you're inspired to recreate them for your home. My goal is to always make these beautiful and affordable. For the first DIY, you will need a framed mirror, foam board, gemstones from the Dollar Tree, and gemstone wrap from Hobby Lobby. I use two packs of the thin gem wrap or you can use the one from Dollar Tree. Starting off, I took the mirror out of the frame to outline the foam board and cut two pieces out. I'm going to make a tray so I'm going to hot glue the two foam board pieces together for a little bit more height and thickness of the tray. Now that the two pieces are glued down, I'm going to add more glue to the top and add the mirror. The gemstone wrap is thick enough to cover the two pieces of foam board and it already has a sticky residue on the back so I didn't glue it down. If you want to make sure that it's not going to come off, you can definitely glue it down. It's all up to you. Now I'm adding a line of hot glue and place the gemstones on top. I put a little bit at a time so it wouldn't dry out. If you don't want the clear gemstones, they also carry red and blue that you can use if that's your favorite color or if that's in your color scheme at home. I wanted a cluster look so I put a few on top of the gems all around. You can add more but I really like the simplicity of just a few on top. And here's how the glam tray turned out you guys. It's so pretty and can be used in many different ways. I added it here to my entryway table to place my keys or wallet on top. Another way you can style this is in your bathroom to organize your lotions or perfumes. You can place this in the living room area to put the remote control on top and a candle. The ideas are endless you guys. If you decide to recreate any of these DIYs I would love to see them so please tag me on Instagram. It's LG Queen Home Decor. For the second DIY, you'll need two foam boards, eight square mirror coasters, E6000 glue, a hot glue gun, box cutter, and bling wrap. Here I'm placing two mirrors on the foam board and gem wrap on the side so you can see how I cut the foam board pieces out. I'm going to make a mirrored box and use this method to cut out eight pieces. I already went ahead and cut the eight pieces out, so I'm grabbing the E6000 glue and putting a little bit on each corner and in the middle. I wanted to use this glue to make sure it's strong and durable since I'm placing two mirrors on each piece. Then I will use the hot glue gun and attach the other foam board on top. I'm adding more E6000 glue to the side of the foam boards and then hot glue the other two foam boards and then attach them to start making my box. Make sure when you're cutting out the pieces that they're exactly the same and no bigger than the other because the box won't work unless they're all the same. 
while the E6000 glue dries, I'm adding hot glue to the inside of the box for a better hold. Add E6000 glue to the side of the foam boards and hot glue on the other to attach them. I didn't add a bottom because I wanted to use this as a flower vase, but you can add it if you want to. Just cut out a smaller piece and glue it on. Now that the box is complete, I'm adding hot glue to the middle of the foam board and put the mirrors on top. To cover the black foam board, I used Dollar Tree bling wrap I had instead for the sides and used the gemstone wrap for the top of the box. Now I'm going to add the gemstone wrap to the top and see how much I need to cut then glue it down. Now grabbing the thin gemstone wrap, I want to add it to the corners of the box to give it more sparkle. And here's how the second DIY turned out you guys. Let me know which DIY is your favorite so far. I made a similar mirrored box like this almost a year ago because I wanted it to be my guest bathroom trash can. I made it with my husband and we used real wood instead for a more secure hold. It still looks just as new and beautiful. Since this one is only going to be used for flowers, the foam boards work great. This can be used for weddings as centerpieces and any party occasion. Or if you're like me, this is an everyday decor piece to glam up your home. I really like the way that this DIY turned out. In today's video, I wanted to do a surprise giveaway to you guys. I'm giving away this glam coaster set as a thank you for being here. 
I have a scent that I really enjoy and I wanted to give one of you the opportunity to enjoy it as well. All you have to do to enter this giveaway is like this video and comment anything down below. That's it. More info will be in the description box. For the last DIY, you will need bling wrap or gemstone wrap in a picture frame. I purchased the picture frame from Dollar Tree. It was such a great find because it comes with a mirror inside. This DIY was super simple. All I did was cut out the gemstone wrap to fit around the mirror. The frame itself is absolutely beautiful, so adding the bling wrap just made it even more glam. This concludes today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and for all your continued love and support. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. I hope you have an amazing new year and achieve many of your goals this year. I'm so thankful to bring in this new year with our baby girl. God is great. Always remember to be thankful for each blessing. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Take care.